hi hello friends welcome to another video so today I'm gonna show you how to set up the scanner settings on the Canon IR3245 so that you can scan from that Xerox machine or the copier machine and the files would save in this desktop or the PC so the connection of my network is very simple I have a router placed there from that router it goes to another extender or you can call it as a mini router this is the TP link from the TP link extender or a small kind of router so what I've done is from one, from the modem one cable comes to this extender and from this extender I've taken two cables one cable goes to this PC and another cable goes to this copier machine so now let's start configuring the scanner settings so before we do anything on the IR3245 or the Canon copier machine let's do some settings on the PC so first thing first we need to create a folder on this PC right click on the desktop click on new click on folder I like to name it as CAD once done just right click on this CAN folder click on properties click on sharing this already shared you can click on share and select the name of the user click share select this click on done click on advanced sharing share this folder I would name it as canned and if required you can make it as everyone select all with full control click apply apply ok close now let's go to the copy machine also we want to verify the IP address that we are getting on this computer to do that open the command prompt so the options are click on start and type in cmd or open command prompt it should open up a prompt like this so now we can type the command ipconfig this will give us the IP address so the IP address is 192.168.0.102 and the subnet mask is 255.255.255.0 so we need to keep the IP address of the copy machine in the same range ok I am near the copy machine first thing we need to power it up we will have to wait for the machine to come up online so now we can click on this star button go to system settings network settings TCP IP settings IPv4 settings we need to make it as on next thing is with the IP address settings 192.168.0.1 it was 102 on the machine so I can give it as I will give it as 82 and subnet mask is gonna be 255.255.255.0 click ok we can test the connectivity by clicking on ping command 2168.0.102 click start ok it says response from the host which means the communication is success now click on done to configure the scanner settings we need to click on sign let's click on address book click on register register address register new address click on file FTP instead of FTP we need to make it as SMB click on O search will give the our group name we will give the IP address of the computer click OK click start searching this is the IP address of the machine click on down it's asking for username and password 
enter the username and password click ok okay this is the folder scanned click ok click ok done done okay now let's try to give a scan copy select the address book and click ok so I have placed a copy here once I have selected here and to click on this option so it scanned the first copy I will give it as done it says it's sent so now I am coming back to my computer this was the folder that I created I am double clicking on that and I see the scanned copy here Alright, if you have found this video informative, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel to never ever miss any of the crazy notifications. Thank you for watching. You have a great day. Bye-bye.